Well, if he should be forced to resign, then all of the Congressional Black Caucus should be forced to resign. You had Maxine Waters say that the Tea Party members should all go to hell. Well, I will tell you where hell is. Hell is in the black communities that the Congressional Black Caucus serves. That's where you can find hell. And the fact is, is that these guys want to all pass the buck on an organization that's less than three years old, as if the Tea Party members are the people shooting up black neighborhoods. The Tea Party members are the reason why there are uh, substandard schools in black neighborhoods or why housing is being foreclosed in black neighborhoods. They don't have to look any further. The people who've hold, held dominion over black people in America for decades are the black members of the Congressional Black Caucus. The problem that they have right now, Megan, is there's nobody else to blame. They can't blame the president because they wanted the black, the black president. Racist that they are, they voted for the man because he's black, not because he's qualified. So between them and the, Congre and the president, they have nowhere to go. The only place they can do, the only thing that they can do is to blame a group that has nothing to do with this. The Tea Party is for con following the Constitution and making government accountable. And also one other point, the government reports to the people, not the other way around. Now, what does that have to do with racism in the black community? I haven't a clue.